vain worship is not political, it's spiritual, a state of heart. The evidence spoken as boasting in their accomplishments by their own power apart from my house and without any need of me. Idolatry, it's a sin of the highest order. My queen, it's the way. They need you to speak about it. The way is my way. It's the way we all need to go now. Love me and the ones that I send your way. I will bless your life with more hope and more joy than you can ever dream of or imagine. I love you and now you know it is so more than anyone on this planet. You know me, my queen, and I do. He loves me. He makes a way for me. He gives me impossible miracles all the time so that I can continue despite difficulties in the, in the natural world. My life has not failed. Psalm 23, you shall not fail. That's what it says. Go read it. Believe me, you will not be left as orphans. You will have everything that is required to live well. Now do not stop. Keep it flowing day and night and I'll let you see me more and more and more as the days continue into this hell on earth. That's what's coming. You flow in my grace and I can't help but adore it when you declare my words and express my love to the ones I have sacrificed my life to save. That's you. Believe and beloved. It's onward and upward to the moon for you, my darling sister. He loves it too, your sight and your spirit. It's endearing, playful, and so sharp, cynical, critical, and very accurate. He is starting to align himself with your words spoken from my heart. It's an influence you have been granted over men, which I'm planning to use to steer them by faith in the right way, my way, my way every day. It's the way we must continue, the way literally, it means literally the way, the way that he lived. It's not rocket science but it's something that requires a little practice to become a master of spiritual navigation. He requires faith and pure love and joy is my reward for your faithful service to these men and women who are waiting every day to hear your voice. Speak and keep speaking. Love and keep loving. Believe and keep believing until I return, amen. I see. You do, you do. I know you do. You see so well and it's because you have put aside inferior order gods of the heart, things which I did not give for you to worship. You give me everything, every day, and that's the way I have made you to be loved. Loved wholeheartedly, totally, completely. It's the way you love that makes me sing. It's the way you love to love that draws men in. It's the lost that need it. They need it so much. The signs are all starting to become so obvious. It's the end of time. It's my time this time. Time and time and time after time. Now is the time to love, love, love. Leave nothing to chance. Leave nothing but the debt of love. Love me more and show them that I have made a way. It's not rocket science, but it does require a pure heart, undefiled motives and faith in my plan to save the least and the greatest of men in these last days. I am number one, the king of all things, creator and judge, the firstborn of men, the sustainer and the lover of all that is lost. Amen. All that is lost. Amen. Tell them now I will never leave you nor forsake you. Do not fear. Do not fear. You have my heart. Declare it to the world. Jesus is king. There is none other. Bow to him. Believe me, you will not see death. You will live because I am alive. I am. It's true. Rest in me.